WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman on this Thursday, September the 30th. Of course, this is the last day of the month. You'll see this candle right here on the monthly chart, dating weekly monthly chart of the Dow. Peak D today, I'd say just subscribe to my opening call. No way they'd be getting an extension of leg D. There will be a peak D. This impossible to get to 35,632 today, no matter what happens. Um, so there will be a peak D. Peak D in the Chapman Wave methodology, I'll do this a little bit in greater detail. I'll also be looking at the S&P uh, in greater detail. I have a lot of questions about that, and I'll talk about it in a, in a buy mode. You want to go to at least a peak D, and then other things can happen. And here we are at a peak D in the monthly chart, G slash C in the weekly, and we've already had our peak E at 35,631 in August of uh, this year at all-time high. The S&P and the Dow's only up nine. It's tried to rally again, cannot make it. That's at 34,406. The S&P is also struggling. It had a bounce, and now it's only up 13 at 43.73. It made its high on the second. There's always rotating tops in the market. So we've got August for the Dow, September for September the second for the S and P at 45.45. We're trading right now at 43.73. That is a peak D. Probably by tomorrow afternoon, I'll be putting a down arrow to say sell signal at least in the weekly chart. Look at the QQQ, NDX 100, having a bit of a bounce today. Some of these. Um, High-tech stocks, especially the tech stocks in general, have been smashed. Some of them are down 18, 19, 21 percent. Uh, so it bounces, uh, you can expect that. It has a little bit of a bounce, up 2.51 and 361.79 in the NDX 100 trading vehicle QQQ. And as I say, we've been short since about uh, the um, 10th or so of September um, in the QQQs. Got a small position for subscribers to my opening call. We're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000. It made its high way back in May, March, sorry, March. And um, these double tops, I'll be talking about that. It's up at point 90. Look at gold. Gold, which has been smacked, is having a nice day today, up 20 at 17.43. Held the low of yesterday. This is very important. And the dollar. The dollar is now in leg E. It's probably going to be pulling back with crude oil, maybe. This is a very important moment. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour, and this is going to be a very interesting show. Hope you can stay and check out my.